hey there, real quick. Um, I'm creating all the short videos because I know that time is precious and I do want to be able to give you up-to-date information. Again, especially if you're in an e-commerce business because I know a lot of you, unfortunately, I don't know how many times I'm gonna say this to you, but you need to be compliant with sales tax. I know you don't wanna hear it, but hey, it's what it is, you know? Um, the same way you pay to Uncle Sam your federal taxes, um, you know, you need to take care of paying your state taxes, yeah. So, um, some of you are not doing it right, and it's going to create a lot of problems. So, here's the issue, okay? Um, California is starting to have, um, uh, they become a little more friendly, or they're trying to be more helpful, if you want to look at it that way. Um, so, if you are selling, and you know, because I I know it's the fact you can pull your reports out of Amazon and eBay and you can actually look at the states where you're selling the most of your products. Please pay attention because in California right now, if you have not, pay attention, if you have not registered yet and have never collected or have but have not paid, um, there's a great opportunity right now so I know most of you are probably selling California state because obviously it's one of the biggest states and um, they do spend a lot of money, by the way. Um, they love buying online. <laughs> so look into your sales reports because if you are selling in California state, right now they're giving great opportunities, okay, for anyone who's doing e-commerce business, okay? Whether you're on Amazon, whether you're on eBay, I don't care what platform, remember sales tax, applies to any platform, okay? It's not exclusively only for one. Um, make sure you reach out to them because right now, instead of going and doing a look back, what's called look back six years, that's how it was with uh, California, they had just recently come up with a new um, plan, which they will only do up to three years instead, which is fantastic because if you have been selling and you have not been collecting at least hopefully you get a little bit of a break there uh, but again you have to register and go under the new plan they have, they have established because if they find you then you lose all your benefits okay so and i'm seeing that a lot of you i don't know what the reason i have created so many videos trying to really assist you um especially all of you out there who are not my current clients and helping you to understand that it's not an option anymore i know you don't want to hear this but it's not an option you must you must collect sales tax in every state that you're selling especially if you have reached that threshold which you know it's different in every state okay some states they tell you that if you sell 200 transactions automatically you have to start paying that state other states tell you ten thousand dollars or 200 transactions so again pay attention look at the table there's plenty of information out there if you if not if you're not sure you're confused which i think a lot of you are still are or thinking that you can get away with looking the other way and you know kind of like ignoring the situation you can because once you reach that threshold they're gonna know and they're gonna come after you remember and i said this in many other previous videos if you haven't watched my channel before subscribe like comment because you know what i create this videos for you it's my time for you because i want to help you i want you to stay in business i really am just serious about this because i see a lot of people getting in trouble and if they hit you with penalties and hit you with interest trust me it's going to be very difficult i don't care how successful you think you are in an online e-commerce that they're coming after you remember again they want their share whether we like it or not I know before we used to get away with no sales tax, but now it's just becoming more and more difficult, okay? I have taken a lot of advanced courses on this, invested a lot of thousands of dollars in, in, my, in my, my education to help you, to, to, to help you stay in business because I'm seeing this happening. They're coming around and by the time they find you, they're going to hit you with all these penalties and all these things and it's just horrible. But so please open your eyes, do the right thing, 
Um, state compliance, especially again, if you're in California, this is a great opportunity. Right now, they have a lot of what they call volunteer, you know, um, uh, um, sellers. Uh, and if you go into the new plan that they just recently created, this is going to super benefit you because instead of looking back, especially if you've been selling for a long time, <laughs> and I know some of you have, uh, they're going to look back only three years. So hopefully you can jump into this phenomenal, you know, opening that they have started um, and it's going to benefit you, okay? So again, if you need a sales or nexus checkup, remember the nexus has to do not with physical presence. It has to do with economical presence, which means that when you're selling in a state, that creates economical presence, okay? Even though you don't have a warehouse there, maybe you don't have employees there, maybe you don't even have independent contractors, but you're selling to that state, that's sufficient for them to call it nexus, okay? So remember, nexus is nothing more than two joints. Two connection, two dots connecting, and that's the way they look at it. You're the seller, you're selling to that state, there's a connection. There you go. Now you have to pay taxes, okay? So I'm not saying to register in every state because, my goodness, that'd be, that'd be ridiculous, you know? I wouldn't even recommend that to my clients. But at least the states that you know that you're doing well, please do yourself a favor. Get compliance because I can assure you, and I'm seeing it, if they find you, you're gonna find yourself in a worse situation. And again, I know some of you out there, you're looking the other way, like saying, it's not gonna to happen to me, it's gonna happen. So please, you get the opportunity right now, do it right, and that way at least you can get that, you know, that weight off your shoulders, okay? Big deal, remember, who's gonna pay for the sales tax? Your consumers, the people who are buying from you. You start collecting that money, Ping them. That's it. All right. Anyhow, once again, this is Liz Soria. If you need my services or my team, we're here for you. That's what we do. We only specialize in e-commerce, and that's what we love doing. Um, uh, you know, I've been a you know from more you know seller also on Amazon, and eBay, so I know what you're going through. I've been in your shoes before, so not only I do what I do as my profession, but I've done it because I wanted to know and I wanted to experiment what it was to be in your shoes. And you know, it's the only way you can do it is by doing it, right? So again, check your sales reports, look at the states that you're selling, compare the amounts, and if you need more assistance than that, we're here to do that checkup for you, and at least you have a peace of mind, all right? Anyhow, I let you go now, and like I said, we're always here for you, so thank you so much, until the next video, bye-bye.